Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Risha and this is For the Love of Classics. So in today's video, I'm going to take you guys with me as I explore some bookstores in London. So the first place I went to was Waterstones in Bromley. Waterstones is like a chain of bookstores in the UK and they have different branches spread throughout London. So the first branch which I visited was the one in the Glades in Bromley in South London. Loved that place. So the second bookstore I stumbled across was in Greenwich, which is also on the south of River Thames. It was a very small bookshop in the Greenwich market and it had classics. The name of the bookshop was Well Read and it was a cute little cozy bookshop full of classics. So I absolutely loved it. The third bookstore which I went to was another Waterstones. This one was in Greenwich. It had kind of a similar vibe to the one I previously visited in Bromley. It was definitely a lot of fun exploring this one as well.
So the fourth bookstore which I went to was actually, I wasn't even planning on going to that bookstore. I didn't even know it existed. I just got off from one station and I was walking to some place I had to go to. Um, I was actually looking for like a shop to return some piece of clothing. And like while I'm walking there, I look on my left and there's a bookstore called Daunt Bookstores. I went in there, it was super cool. And I later found out like it's really, really famous as well. So I loved, loved, loved this bookstore. They had like a diverse collection of books. They had like a separate section for Pakistan, which I was really excited about. I feel like Waterstones didn't have that, like as diverse collection of books as this bookstore did. I really enjoyed exploring this shop. The next bookshop which I went to was a bookshop slash cafe and I spent the whole day in that store. It was like an old bookshop. It's called High Kante Book. I'm going to accept, insert the name of the bookshop here because I think I'm going to butcher the pronunciation. I thought I could speak English. I cannot speak English when I'm talking to British people. I cannot speak to people as comfortably as I thought I would be able to because everyone has such different accents and they talk quickly and they use words which I never thought of ever using. I mean the vacuum cleaner is not the vacuum cleaner, it's Hoover. Anyways, I absolutely loved this bookshop. So I had googled this place before I went here so I knew what to expect but it exceeded expectation. I sat down in there, read for a while, explored the bookshop for hours, basically spent the entire day here and I'm so happy I did. It was a beautiful, wonderful day.
next bookstore which I visited was called Blackheath Bookshop. It was a small cozy bookshop. Loved it so much. Went there with a friend and we had a great time browsing through the books. Then I visited another Waterstones. This one was in Canary Wharf. I feel like all the Waterstones have a pretty similar vibe. Uh, I mean, the interiors do match, even if the book collections don't necessarily match 100%. But this was another bookshop I had no clue was there, but I stumbled across it anyways. I think those would be all the bookstores I have visited until now. Let me know down in the comments if you want me to visit some other spectacular bookshops in London. I would love to get some recommendations. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did please don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like this video if you haven't done it already and I will see you all in my next video very very soon. Bye!